Civil War is, as I mentioned earlier, the firing of the cannon. Lou Golovker has been the cannon firer for a number of years. He may be the most experienced and best and most efficient cannon firer there is at Camp Eklund. How many years have you uh, performed this ceremony of firing the cannon to begin color work? I've been doing this about seven years now. Seven years. Uh, is, is it true that you're an attorney, but that this is really your first profession? This is my first profession. I only moonlight as an attorney. <laughs> uh, anyone who thinks that my primary function is as an attorney is, is wrong. This is my, my true job. Uh, Lou Golovka, of course, being the brother of Stephen and the son of Marty, has uh, family connections to Camp Equinox. Uh, when were you a camper? What year was your first year at this camp? I started out in 1958. I was four and a half years old. I was in bunk one twice. Uh, and I, my opening year was 1959. Now we will, for the first time, uh, show has this camera ever been, has this uh, cannon ever been recorded on videotape before? On videotape, no. It has been recorded on film, but film. with a very restricted audience. This is, this is uh, uh, almost akin to a CIA uh, confidential Absolutely. security. Here Absolutely. it is, ladies and gentlemen. Here's what it looks like. It's like the first view of the atomic bomb, something close to that. Here we are. Oh, is that disappointing? That little... <laughs> <laughs> we expected a very big cannon. Is that all there is? That's if all there is. We get this a little bit more in focus here. That's all there is. Uh, there's the focus. That is the cannon. And how does it work, uh, Lewis? It takes... Uh, Why don't you bend down and just uh, give us a little... 10-gauge uh, blank shotgun shell. Sh shotgun shell. Goes in the back. Goes in the back. Where's the, where's the shotgun shell? Let me, let me get a close-up of that. There it is. Is there any bullet in that shell, though? That's the question. No, not no. at all. Just plain a blank. Just blank. Nothing in it. And he puts it in. And put it in. And pulls it, and uh, all the kids hear that cannon, and for years and years and years, that has been the traditional opening of uh, Color War. Well, thank you very much. We'll see you later, Lois.